Okay guys, we, uh, we've uh, just finished the video for us cutting up the, the fallen trees and we've carried them to uh, our neighbor Scott and he is milling them now. So we are going to drive, we're driving there now. We're gonna drive over there and see what he's got going on. He has a, I believe it's a Norwood, um, a Norwood sawmill. And so he's going to be uh, showing us how he how he does that and, and the particulars to that. He's even going to let me play a little bit on the sawmill and, and uh, what that will look like. So we're driving there now. We're driving out of the farm. Get that. It's got a centrifugal clutch here. This is the blade of the belt tensioner. This it's got belts that go around both of these wheels that actually grab the blade. I'll be darned. Like a shoe almost. Yeah, kinda like a shoe. These little guides here keep it in line. I just put a new blade on and I hit a piece of metal a while ago. Oh no, in one of them pine trees? Yeah. Really? <clears throat> wow. You don't know what's been in them pine trees all these years. No. And that's a Norwood? Yeah. I've had this since 2012, 2013. The only thing I've ever had to do to it is uh, change the plates. Yeah. And what is that a color or? Yeah, it's a 14 horse color. <laughs> Change the oil once a year, so. Yeah. It has uh, water lubrication in here. It goes down and it sprays water on the blade. That helps keep the curb cleaned out. Consequently, all your boards wind up wet, but it doesn't take them long to dry out. Yeah. This is the gauge up and down. This is the three is for a three quarter inch board. The four is for a one inch, four quarter, five quarter, six quarter, and then uh, whatever that is. I got the glasses on. How about that? Or you got the measuring stick. I use the red line for when I'm measuring. Yeah. We'll crank it up. Crank it up and see what it'll do.
square can. That's your what you want to get to. It'd be the board will be 13 and a quarter inches wide, and I'll get a dozen of them out of it. Shoot, that's good stuff. So what we're doing is we're putting these um these uh I call them staves. I don't know what the technical term is. Because I'm an old country boy, not a lumberjack. But um, you put them in there and you stack them up so that it'll air dry. And uh, for our East Texas climate, four to six months. It's a little rainy out right now, but oh, in February, come April, May, Father Summer, Grandfather Summer is coming to get us. And uh, it'll cure up nicely, so. So we shall see what we end up building with, building out of this. But, uh, but there it is. God bless.